Ibo mo na egenti, ay ne kenu no so, mo bo sinke ta. Ai so kwanko echiri, ya selo. Dalo le ne kunse sa ela ni fine me. Ai na kunse sa ela ya. Ai so me ka tuko ka bia ma bless us, ise, ise, ise. All right, the course na ga ya bop ni oso, e fine well. Ya bu if you na ji go bo abo. One of our brother division 555. I I salute you, sir. You just hit the hammer on the nail. All Biaflans need to listen to this. Our brother revealed a shocking secret that we shock the Biaflans. As in, just Simon Iboni Ibo. Gaya beef. Gaya beef. Gaya beef. Don't skip any. Our brother revealed a powerful secret that will shock you. Kai, Mazen and the canoe with a mother. Mazen and the canoe with a mother. Maz Simon Epa with a mother. Because Bia France again here, then divorce with your own comment on the comments from below. All right, um, over to you, over to you, Division 555. Over to you, sir. You, I said Biafran. I said Biafra, when we mean Biafra, we are talking about this new. 32 states that make up Biafra, starting from B Edo, Edo State, covering everywhere. All these people have a K, Orie, A4, Nkwo. That is their four market days. Oh, that is their four market days, and the language started there. A K. Our people used to give them a K, Mbweke. Mbore, okeke, okore, okafo, okonkwo. Missionary journeys came. They told you that you should be baptized in the name of Jesus. Your name was Ahamefuna, okeke. They give you baptism name. They took okeke out. Then they give you Ahamefuna Michael. Or they give you Okeke Michael. One name is missing. We are talking now about Ahamefuna. Now, destruction of Nigeria, 1999 constitution, made it that. Muslim Muslim ticket, when Muslim Muslim ticket take over, which is Tinibu and the Shetima, the one that will happen on 29. Fulanese will then establish full food in the school that everybody must speak full food in school, Nigeria school, because Nigeria now has be automatically become a Muslim country. The same Nigeria pastors are praying for. Fulanis has another name they want to change to that contraption that will fit to their own. How many people know the name here, please? Because I forgot it. I have right to forget. How many people know the new name of Nigeria, which is, in, is, is, is still inside the constitution of Nigeria, that they will change the name Nigeria? Fulanis will still change the name called Nigeria, which you are praying for Mazen now the kind of say anybody who pray for one nigeria is a monkey is better than that person and you are praying you see muslim ticket muslim muslim ticket automatically islamization if you go to google 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 nigeria nigeria will tell you that nigeria is muslim nation then on 29th nigeria will be automatic Muslim Muslim will become a Muslim nation recognized by global nation then you who is a pastor my question now is Fulanis has an agenda that when Muslim Muslim take ticket take place if you want to owe a church you have to be paying the government or you have to be employed inside your did there somebody write it? Bridge update coming. Uh, go on posting. Okay. So the Fulanis are there. 
Fulanis are they waiting that whenever this Muslim Muslim ticket pass through, pass by, then pastors will lose their churches. If you want to walk, then the government will have to pay you, just like he teaches. And they will tell you how many times you will mention the name of Jesus a day until it will be eliminated. And everybody will learn Fufu there in the school. And when you learn Fufu there, you will change your name. I have made food now. That is what our leader says here now. Then, if you want to get a reasonable work in Nigeria, that means you need to attach that a, now your name is, is, is okay, okay, Michael. You Now you have to remove that okay, okay. It will remain Michael Usman. Um, Johnson, Harona. That is what is coming for you people if you don't know. And what do you do to prevent it? That is the question. The only thing you can do to prevent it is to listen to Simon Eber who is bringing a new dimension to this very awareness we are making. Listen to him and share his broadcast accordingly. Those people who is sharing, taking small, small of his knowledge to share this message, share our own as well. Let us go to our By leader. answering Nigeria, you have abandoned your name, you have abandoned your traditions and your heritage. That is what therefore is here to reverse. <laughs> Everybody can gang up against us if they wish. But we want to make this victory in such a way that everybody who is a Biafran will worship God forever and ever. <laughs> because the delivery of Biafra from bondage, the expectation of the children of the Most High God, Shiko Abiyama, from that very abominable entity, will indicate to you once and for all that indeed, Shiko Abiyama is a Biafran. Shiko Abiyama is a Biafran. Your name is okay, Chuku. Chuku Abiyama is a Biafran. Your name is Chedema. Chuku Abiyama is a Biafran. Your name is Chuku Ode. Chuku Abiyama is a Biafran. Your name is Chijioke. Chuku Abiyama is a Biafran. Your name is Chuku Ode. Chuku Abiyama is a Biafran. How? Which other way do you people want us to pass this message? For you to know. And what are you waiting to share it? What are you waiting to invite others and give them idea? Chukwa Biyama is a Biafra. Chukwa Kika Biyama. And again, the archaeology, the strongest archaeologist of this world says that the history of this world will never be complete until Africa is revisited. And then, you people will then understand the secret inside the Old Testament. What is Old Testament? The history of the Igbos are written inside the Old Testament. Are you telling me that Amadi Oha that he killed, that he used to fight with the fire? Are you telling me that Elijah, the history of Elijah is not the history of Amadi Oha? How many people is reasoning with us here? Write us comment. Elijah, they said he is in Israel. When is Israel formulated in 1948? And when was Biafra? And when was the time when Elijah used to fight with the fire? They said that um, Samson, Samson, I will bring something here and I would like people to write comment. And even if you don't watch it live, when you come write your comment, we will get to it. Samson in the Bible, they said Samson used his hand and they killed a lion. How many people know uh, this famous story? Then we tell you that the history inside the New Old Testament is uh, the history of Ndibo. On Ndibo, Igbo people used to have that title and the name Ubuago. Ubuago, Ubuago family. Is it true? Is it true? Then go and check. Does lion exist in Israel? These are critical questions. You should ask. Lion does not exist in Israel. Then, where does Samson got a lion he killed? 
he, he killed with his bare hand. Lion does not exist today in Israel. Check the age of Samson. Check the age of the uh, of when our people begin to bear Obuago as a name. The history inside in Old Testament will be revealed. The secret behind the Old Testament will be revealed when Biafra is finally actualized. Are you people don't you people doesn't know that Britain has the map and the everything the history of Ndibo? Britain have it, it is inside the ancient library. We are Mazen Nandekam and Uche for used to go to read before they, 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 they develop their brain and they come to, to send this message that they motivate some of us. History of Old Testament is not the people of the Middle East. The history of Old Testament are me and you, the Biafrans, the Igbo people. But they changed it because Britain want to capture the land in the Middle East. Then they delivered the history of Igbo people, the, the power Igbo people possess. If if I need Vitalis, thank you. Yeah, the kind of power Igbo people possess the, because Chukwu Kike is our God. That's why you give your children, you rename your children after God. Muslim Nandekano has been teaching this thing long, long, long time ago. That we were there before the first boat landed, before second boat landed, before third boat landed. All of them very close. Some came from Ethiopia. Some came and they stopped uh, very close to Benin. Some came, some came and they stopped very close to River Niger. There you can get a palace. How do they come? Particularly, personally, we have. Israeli people as close friends, as a family friends, they themselves say they came from us, not us coming from them. They left from us, they would sojourn in the Middle East. And the true God, you can trace back the how they returned. When they returned, there are people who have been occupying that place. That's why they say Agurese Jebendibo. When you go to Igbo land, you will see some places that is called Umu Ezigwe, Umu Ajala, Umu Igwe, Umu Chuku, Umu Chuku. Who gave them that name? Retain your name, retain your identity. And the only thing that can make you to retain that your identity is Biafra. The only thing that can make you to have peace of mind in this life again is Biafra. Nothing more. That's why we already found the truth. We decided to say the truth out and we voice it out the way it's supposed to be. The way it's supposed to, people will understand it. That's why Martin Nambekano does not speak big British English. That's why Samuel Emba does not speak those big, big English. We speak that one, everybody will understand, even pigeon. Now we talk. So that everybody will, will, will follow. Everybody will follow. But let our people learn how to turn, turn their network to what is really happening, to what is going on. Our people should turn their network, especially the comedians. Our people like easy things. Comedians, they will make you fun, but the strong people will never laugh. Do you see Simon Eba laughing? Do you see Gaddafi laughing? Do you see Abarawa laughing? Do you see 247 laughing? Do you see Nandekano laughing? Do you see all those our uh, warriors laughing? The one you can the, the people you can't even see their face. Our message is penetrating. It's penetrating and it is bearing mighty fruit. Let's hear from Oyen do small. There's nothing before. That Biafra must emerge. We must come to exist. We are not going to ask for anything that doesn't belong to us. We are not asking for any territory or resources. All we are asking them to do is to leave us alone. Leave us alone. The same way we were before the British came. We have the documentation. 
to prove that we never gave the British the consent to form one Nigeria in the first place. We have the documents. The documents we signed with them was to trade with Royal Niger Company. It says, we have the documents. The document we have with Britain is to trade with the Royal Niger Company. Why then are, have they turned it and they call it a country, call it Nigeria? And a pastor that say he suck his mother's breast will come up in the church where there are a multitude. He will tell you, go and pray for something that is illegal. The document they signed was to trade with the Royal Niger Company. Then when they visit Royal Niger Company, now they target Nigeria and they push pastors along with the missionary journeys to make sure that everybody believe in the name called Nigeria. Nigeria is green, white, green. Have they fought any war to get Nigeria? No. Even when they are trying to make Nigeria a living country, the original, original map of, um, of Nigeria was having the star of David. It was having the star of David in it for you to know that the Afrans, the Igbos, are the real owner of Nigeria. The real owner of Nigeria are the Igbos. The star of David we are, was there. And this David they are telling you, where did they bring, where did David come from? Where did he come from? These are the people who left from our land when the, the continent was one. They sojourned to the other side. Igbos has been in existence from time immemorial. If you go to Genesis, they will tell you that God mowed human being with sand. And we have come across some books that is 1,000 1, questions and 1,000 answers. They told you how human beings begin. And the pastors doesn't even want to let you understand that human beings are growing and changing. Growing and changing, growing and changing until we come to this form. And AI intelligence is telling you that human being is going to a robot. How many people knows, or how, how many people want to argue? Human being are turning to robot, and the evidences are there. Evidences are there. The way they are turning to robot. If you don't understand it, ask me a question. Let me let me let me in define it. How human being are turning to robot, and they say that human being does not come from ape. Pastors doesn't want anybody to think about that area. But to go back to ancient libraries, go back to geography, go back and find found do foundings on your own. You will see some apes that has human form. And when they cover the face, you will see that this thing has now a human being. And they are changing. The way you look now is not the way your father looks. It's not the way your grandfather look. Take yourself. Look to your own children. Look at your father. Look at your grand grandfather. Look. How, check. Imagine how the other pers other people are. And your children, you see how they are growing. The the, the the head here is now coming up. Before people used to have mango hair. Now it's not too much. The hair is coming up. And the people are thinking faster, more than how it was before. And the, 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 the power or the, the, the quantity of brain people has olden days is most more is very small to compare the brain inside people of disease. The brain is more in number in, in quantity now than people of old days. Try to go to your science, try to go and check the area, pastors, especially pastors. Miss the game because they are the people when you have family problem, your husband will run away looking for pastor who will come and they settle his her family problem for him. Your wife will run away looking for a pastor that will come and settle his family problem for him. But these people are leading us to nowhere, leading us to nowhere. In as much as there is a pastor you know that has prayed for Peter, be there that person that he don't even know his left. From his right, you copy this area, send it to Chris Economy, send it to a mobile, send it to Oyedebo, send it to Adeboye. All of them, they don't even know their left from their right, they don't even know, they don't know, they don't know their left from their right. 
And what we are showing our face is a K is with us. Only is with us. And for is with us. Unquo is with us. We will send this message and nothing will happen. We've been sending this message when Nandekano was facing the biggest challenge. Nothing happened. It is time now, Simon. Never. The only problem Simon is having is because the people who supported Mazen Nandekano to restore Biafra in tied war, in met war. That is the problem of Simon. Never. And we are doing our best to make sure that we put those things they miss in their brain. Those things that is not in their brain, we are trying to fix those things back. A lot of people are now understanding the development of Simon Eber. If, if uh, DOS did not channel their war to Simon Eber, maybe Nandekano will be out by now. Maybe Biafra would have been declared by now. But they start inside war. In, inside war. Inside war is more dangerous than whatever you can think. Let's listen to Onion do then we call the it. The consent to them and from Nigeria. This is one thing that the so-called band of Nigerian intellectuals never ever bother to ask themselves, including the Yorubas, Wolfinka in particular. Did we give our consent to Lugard to go and form Nigeria? The answer is no, we did not. Where did they derive the authority to go to form that zoo? Why did they hand over to a group of black men that continued the same slavish mentality impacted upon them by their masters? No wonder they are incapable of civilization. They are incapable of human development. The one who looks down, I understand, is here. Is that not correct? The sun is here. Dancing from one night club to another, making positives very, very rich on your money. China. And some of us go to that night club to go and clean that night club to be able to feed and pay house rent. That money is coming from your land. The one who look man is here in Austria with money stolen from Biafra. Him and the children are living at large, having fun. In the morning, we will go to the nightclub where the son went to party to go and clean that nightclub that we can get money to feed. <laughs> and uh, after cleaning that night job, that night work now, after cleaning that night work, you will still take the money you work cleaning the nightclub which they took your money from Nigeria and the son, the person who took it away from Nigeria, he came to Europe he enjoy with the money Europeans took their own. Then you go there, you will go and wash the sheet and the everything. The person messed up there. Then you will still send that money back to Nigeria. The person will still bring it back again. You see the kind of mess we are into? <laughs> the kind of mess we are into is, is, is I don't understand. Oil belongs to us. They will go there, they will take the oil that belongs to us. Someone come to your father's house or Baji, then he will take over it and he give you one yam. Go and celebrate. Then you are the only person that can eat in the community. Then I say the Igbo people then turn the adage that says, Ngema Jiji, Ngiji Mwanye Wanye Yari. Man, all Baji is your own. Ndibo, we will we, we, we send this message without looking at anybody's face. Check this thing. Copy this message, send it to Cardinal Arins. Copy it, send it to Chris Ayekinomi. Copy it, send it to a more by Ananche Jeremiah. Uh, all the pastor you know that has prayed for P2B. Tell them they don't know who is Jesus. That they don't even know their God. They don't know the God they are calling. They are deceiving people. They are deceiving people. They are not telling people the truth. They are not telling people what they're supposed to know. They are not telling people what they're supposed to know. It's just like this is stupid they make a living stone. These are the people that made our people to be like the, the way they are. Passing wrong information. Passing wrong information. A make a living stone. You call yourself a pastor. You pass very dirty information to the public. And the people will believe you because you put to suit. As a, as a pastor, you put tie. When you put suit and tie, then that is the mentality of our people. 
anybody who puts suit and tie to and start in a, in the congregation you speak in british english then that person have easy access to capture the brain of our people and michael livingstone you call him a pastor the kind of people we will follow the kind of people that need us to follow him let's listen to onyendu let's listen to onyendu please only an animal can allow that to happen. Not a sensible human being. Why do you think everybody revolted in the world? That is the sign of civilization. When you revolt against any oppressive regime or system, that is the sign that you are now matured as a human being. Or else you're an animal. You are an animal. When we preach the gospel on radio, Biafra, we tell you the truth. If you have any counter opinion, you present it. People shouldn't look at us and say, Oh, you see, Radio Biafra was the temple, but you see how they devour the temple. The temple which Mazen Nambe can build, and he said in Radio Biafra, we worship. You see how they devour that place, they use that place as a place of criticism. And who are they criticizing? Biafran government in exile. That is exactly what they are criticizing. And our message will end here by if you get small key on how to de yeah, deliver this information, those people you read in the Bible, there is no other way they did their own. Eh? All those Elijah, Elisha, Jeremiah, Ezekiel. Only that they see, they found out that things is not normal. Things don't supposed to go the way it is going. They say, man, I can't continue with this nonsense. That is the reason. Then they call on Chuko Kikabiyama. Chuko Kikabiyama say, go. Like in the book of Jeremiah, say, I will put my word in you, you will speak. That is what we are doing. We are not doing it because we can speak better than you, who is not speaking. We are doing it because enough is enough. And we look upon the face of Chuko Kikabi Ama, we say, send us this journey, we will go. He said, okay, if you are ready, I will, I will send you. He gave us a message, and we are delivering the message. And as we are delivering the message, you see, our sister, Flora Akubilo, he, she blessed me with a big time super chat. Because she appreciates what we are doing. Any other person that appreciates what we are doing, support us, however, it's not because that is what we, where we depend ourselves to, to live. This computer you see here, we bought it with a big amount of money. You understand? But appreciation, that is that is the thing. The way we are appreciating Simon ever. But don't forget, pass the information today. Today is fundraising. Because if you need freedom, don't just stay at home for other people to fight Biafra for you. Try to contribute. That's when Biafra finally comes, which Biafra is coming soon, soon, soon. You can be proud and say, this is my contribution. I couldn't make video. I couldn't do this. I couldn't be ESN, but I put my money there. You don't put your money inside a, a man like you. You put your money inside his pocket. He'll be living large, driving private jet, flying all, 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 all around, and you are dying. When you are dying, he is not even ready to, to, to give you anything back. And how are they deceiving you? Delivering wrong information. That is the reason why they are deceiving you. We are not against them driving their private jet. But remember that Bobby, without Biafra, there is nothing like it. I'm so much happy. I'm so much happy. Our blood that really opens more our eyes. If I need to be for myself, I'm not the kind of nephew. If I need to be your man, don't you do? Now that I can say I can nephew. Thank you so much, Vision Five Five Five. I I I salute you. I'm so much happy. Keep it on and keep pushing. At the end, the Biafra will come. Isa, Isa, Isa. Once again, don't forget to subscribe. Stay tuned at Eastern News Twenty Four. Morning's update is coming. Dalon de Bay, Kemesiano.